Now remember, if you like saws, axes, splitting wood, chainsaws, splitting wood, axes, Woolies World is the place to be. Hit that subscribe button, thumbs up, bell notification, all that jazz. Yes guys, got all the old chainsaw gear on here. It's time for the battle of the saws. Husqvarna. Husqvarna versus Baco. <laughs> yeah, you thought it was about chainsaws. It's not. Not today. Okay, so guys, this is your 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 Baco Laplander saw. Uh, you you know how much I'm going to turn you around a bit, so so I have better light. You you know how much I uh, I I rate this saw. The Baco Laplander folding saw, guys, it's it's what as I regard as the best bushcraft saw in the world. Okay, I'm not going to go into that. Okay, uh, so I came across this on the internet while I was actually looking to buy one of these. This is also a Husqvarna, as you can see, and I thought, hey, Tanner. A shot isn't it just to see how it is now this is this is sort of along the lines of uh, a saw that the kids can use down at red branch as a you know as opposed to a pruning pruning saw uh, so we I've just taken the delivery of a load of new Laplanders there because I'm phasing out the other saws that I was using uh, and just Laplanders are but you know they're they're the industry standard as far as I'm concerned. They are the best folding saws for bushcraft use. Very forgiving, very well made, you know. So uh, I just wanted to see how this little guy got on, okay? So behind me, to uh, what is remaining of the beech hedge that, uh, that was planted here. Somebody's spreading slurry, boy. Jesus Christ, it stinks. What remains of the beech hedge that... Uh, that was planted here. Let me just zoom that in and figure that out. There we go. Okay, that's what's left of the beach hedge, guys. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start off with the with with the Husqvarna. See what it's like. You guys see me okay? Yes. Okay. First cut, just out of the packet. All right. Pretty good. You guys see that okay? It's pretty good. It's pretty good guys. So got a secure it's very secure locking as well I have to say so it's the push the button to, to unlock it and fold it and then it locks closed as well so you have to push the button to unlock it which is cool okay so let's 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 try the old Laplander now this this is an old saw so Okay, not a fair comparison, older saw and stuff like that, but the Husqvarna kicked its arse there, kicked its arse. Okay, let me go get a new Laplander and we'll see. New Baco, they're not, uh, it's not a Laplander, but guys, as far as I can tell, it's the same thing without the black coating. Uh, now, I did go to replace the Laplanders, and they were 30 quid each. 30 quid! This was 20 quid. You know, I got a few of these. So let's let's see how it performs. Better zoom you in again. Let's go for... 
Now nah, we'll, we'll, we'll go to the same one. Where is the bloody thing? It's really hard to make anything out, sorry. There we go, that's a bit better. Now this is fresh, obviously guys, this, 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 this tree is still alive. Uh, as you can see from the leaves and stuff, but I am removing them and, and planting other stuff. Uh, so, Gotta say, I gotta say, guys, Oscar Varn is much better on the cutting test. Much, much better. Now, let's try this. <laughs> this one? You guys see that? Now that's a beast. That is a beast. Okay. Let's 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 get some up close shots. Okay, Husqvarna, Husqvarna. Okay, guys, look. So if I was using a saw like this, uh, I wouldn't put my hand beside it here because they have a tendency to jump. And if they're going to jump, they're going to hit you in the hand here. It's always going to jump in the way. So what I would normally do is I would put my hand over the top like this to stop it from jumping. But guys, I can't. I, well, I can't, but I don't want to do that because of this, uh, because of the video. Okay. So let me just move you down and zoom me in, sorry. Well that is you zoomed in. Okay. Husqvarna. So what I'm doing guys is I'm moving my hand back as far as possible. Okay, I do have a little bit of a branch here. So. Nice. Buckle. It definitely is slower. Definitely is slower guys and, and um, what I would say is that it actually the buckle felt smoother but when you compare them this is the Husqvarna side this is the Husqvarna side this is the buckle side there is a bit of a difference there is a bit of a difference guys so for a tanner you know, when you talk about how many of these I, I would go through, yeah. longevity is, is, is something that we'll have to see, do you know what I mean? But uh, look at my close up. Longevity guys is, is, is something that I can't obviously test here. so. Uh, we're just going to have to see how to perform, but yeah, so far, so far the 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 Husqvarna saw won that one. Now I'd be interested to know where they're made, 
has a very comfy handle very very comfy handle i like this 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 grip at the end here it's got a rubberized texture as does the does the back -o, but this is just comfier you know so yeah overall a nice saw guys a nice nice saw uh if you guys are wondering why I have an orange Laplander, it's so the kids don't lose them in the forest. Which always seems to happen with these ones. Even though I have sprayed all my saws a luminous yellow, they still end up getting lost in the forest. And I was down cutting stuff yesterday, that video hasn't come out yet, and I actually found one hung up in a tree. So that, that one, that's been hung up in a tree for a long time, like October last year. <laughs> Well, anyway guys, just a little short one for you. Uh, I do just want to show you something. That's all you're going to see of that for now. Stay frosty. Oh yeah, Husqvarna one. Like an afterthought. What do you mean, Molly Husqvarna one? Yeah, Husqvarna one, guys. In, in that test, the Husqvarna saw cut faster than the Laplander saw. Stay frosty.